Hello friends. I am Dr. Chirantan Bose from the Department of Molecular and Precision Oncology at MOC. Today, I would like to discuss with you the question of progress and refractoriness of cancers. When a cancer patient initially comes to us, we start usually with standard of care treatment. Standard of care treatments are well defined in the guidelines and in most instances lead to prolonged durable outcome that is success of treatment. The patient remain disease free for long periods of time. Most patients are even cured. But those instances where the cancer is very complex, for example, hepatobiliary cancers, triple negative breast cancers, or the patient has been heavily pretreated. There are instances when the patient comes back with a relapse or recurrence. This is a complex situation. This is a situation where the oncologists use their skill and their knowledge and experience to de design a specific personalized treatment for the patient. This is the area which is strongly supported by molecular oncology science. In molecular oncology, we are able to identify the specific genetic and molecular mechanisms which are leading to resistance and also identify those changes which can be addressed by newer drugs available in the market. This precision oncology helps us to personalize treatment for patients. Cancer treatment can be broadly categorized on the medical oncology front into uh, chemotherapeutic drugs, target drugs, immunotherapy drugs, and hormonal agents. It is the power of combining these into the right personalized combination which helps us to get the best outcome for patients. But how do we decide the right combination for a patient. That is where a molecular workup of the cancer helps us to identify the mechanisms which are working in a given patient and choose the right set of drugs which can be given to the patient to attain best desirable outcomes and also the least side effects. This is the area of personalized precision medicine which we are using for almost all patients that come to MOC with advanced refractory cancers. Thank you.